hello guys welcome to my channel today in this video i'm going to show you how to fix this error code that is error code 14136002s7 a so if you're receiving this error with battlefield 6 game on your windows computer then please follow the steps shown in this video now to fix it you can go to this ea website the link is provided in the video description open this link in a browser it will take you to the official ea website over here you can see download the ea javelin anti-cheat installer click on it and then run this exe file So let the download complete. The download will take some time. Now you can run this exe file. Click on yes to allow. Now over here click on the drop down option and then select battlefield 6. Now click on repair. Click on ok. Go to the game installation folder. So wherever the game is installed. In my case, the game is installed in this location. So go to the game installation folder, select the complete Battlefield 6 folder and then click on select folder over here. And let the repair complete. Uh, once you see install success, then you can try to relaunch the game. Uh, the repair may take some time. And now you, here you can see install success. Now you can relaunch the game and then check. You should not receive the error anymore but still you are receiving the error in that case you can select battlefield 6 once again over here and then click on update and once the update is success during the update ea javelin anti-cheat setup may restart once you see update success now again you relaunch the game and then check still not working then again select battlefield 6 and then click on uninstall and then click on install and once the install is success once again relaunch the game and then check this may take some time now here you can see install success now again relaunch the game and then check still not working select battlefield 6 once again click on uninstall do not install this time close this instead you can relaunch the game from here now over here you can see it's uh, if you see if you receive a prompt to click, click on yes to allow click on yes to allow and during the launch it will reinstall ea anti cheat and you should be able to launch the game and you should not receive this error anymore. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.